Mr. John Cena. That was some war we had last week. Now I ain't mad that you won, because MVP looks good even when he loses. That was one hell of a match, MVP. Now that you're the number one contender, you can bet Orton has some things up his sleeve. Wouldn't mind helping you against him and his cronies. Come track me down. I have a plan to initiate a kind of preemptive strike. Sounds good. I'll swing by in a bit. Raw is live from Boston, Massachusetts. I'm Michael Cole, along with Jerry the King Lawler. And for WWE champion Randy Orton, life has gotten a little more complicated. Well, with John Cena as the number one contender by virtue of his victory over MVP last week, the Viper has problems. In just one week, the two will square off at Royal Rumble for the WWE Championship. Maurice, I beat them for you, lass. You and I are so good together. Uh, Maurice! I'm going to pretend I didn't see this. Of course I didn't want to team up with Seamus. What would I want with a guy who looks like a zombie carrot? But... It was all worth it to see Kelly walks out of there a loser. Well, enjoy it while it lasts, Maurice. Because no matter who you bring with you to fight your battles, you're never going to beat me. Think you can help Cena get to Orton? You can't even help yourself. Is this a two for one sale on losers? Daddy's boy down, one more to go.
Go run home crying to your first-generation superstar daddies. This isn't over, Cena. You're never going to make it to the Royal Rumble. Well, you better come with more than that next time, pal. Randy didn't wait long before he started lobbing grenades, did he? And like usual, his plan didn't work out as he hoped. But he'll try again. And we'll beat him back again. Because you're going to stomp Orton at the Royal Rumble. That means I got...